You've probably heard the word algorithm before. Broadly speaking, an algorithm is a list of instructions for completing a task or solving a problem. Think of it as a cooking recipe. If you want to bake something, like a chocolate cake for example, you will need to add certain ingredients and follow specific steps. And then, presto! You'll have yourself a chocolate cake. The recipe you followed to make this cake was essentially an algorithm. Now, you might be wondering, how does this apply to the internet? You already know that when you go online to use a music app, a social media app, or even to search for something, your personal information is collected. This data becomes the ingredients sites and apps use to create their recipes, or algorithms. Although the exact algorithm that each platform uses is different, they are all essentially designed to do the same thing. To keep you using their site for as long as possible by feeding you information and advertisements that align with your interests. Because, after all, most apps and websites are businesses, and their aim is to make money. So, what are some of the ingredients algorithms look for? Here is just a partial list. Information you provide when you sign up, such as your name, email address, and age. Content you upload, like photos, videos, audio recordings, and more. Anything you share, like, or comment on. Information you share through surveys, challenges, sweepstakes, or contests. How you use the app and how long you view something. Your geolocation data. Your browsing or search history. Your keystroke patterns or rhythms. Sometimes even your phone and social network contacts. That's a lot of information. The next time you sign up for a new app or log into your favorite social feed, you might consider checking out your privacy settings to learn more about the data you're handing over. We'll explore this more in the next lesson. For now, let's get back to that cake. <laughs>